Hey guys, Coach Mike here. And this time I've got a great question for you coming from Kristen, who's a varsity level lacrosse player. And she writes in and she asks, Dear Coach Mike, I'm really interested in taking my game to the next level so that I can maybe play in college. My coaches have suggested that I get into the weight room to increase my strength and speed. But I'm worried that weight training for my lower body will make me look really bulky and maybe slow me down. Any advice? Well, Kristen, this is actually a pretty common concern amongst female athletes because, in my experience, it seems that a lot of you think that simply walking into a gym and touching a weight is going to all of a sudden make you into the Incredible Hulk. Well, it's not quite that easy. In order for gains in muscle hypertrophy or muscle size to take place, you need to have a couple of things in order. One, you need to be consistently taking in a caloric surplus, or in other words, eating more calories than your body needs on a daily basis, specifically from protein and complex carbohydrates. The other thing that you need is you need a hormonal environment that's conducive to gains in muscle size. And since females don't have anywhere near as much testosterone raging through their bodies as males do, it's going to be a little bit more difficult for you guys to gain large quantities of muscle mass. So that really isn't much of a concern. Now, your coaches are spot on in recommending that you get into the gym, because as long as you're doing the right kinds of drills with proper form, you can absolutely increase your strength, your explosive power, your speed, and most importantly, reduce your risk for injuries, especially lower body injuries like twisted or sprained ankles or that dreaded ACL injury. So here's what I'd like you to do. Take a look at the video that appears directly underneath this one. It's a simple gym-based strengthening routine that I've come up with for female athletes that originally ran on inside of the cross. I think you'll find the drills extremely useful, pretty easy to get started with, and then you can always add more resistance as you get stronger and your needs change. Hope that answered your question, and don't forget the rest of you out there, keep sending those questions in because next time I might be answering yours. Take it easy, I'll see you next time.